Welcome to Inawara's Simplify SAP Create It Now series. In this video, we will utilize Process Runner to create two BAPI scripts, one to create notes, followed by one to add them to a profit center in SAP. Here in Excel, we have the notes we will be creating and adding. Before we get started, let's take a quick look at SAP at our profit center group H1 to see its existing notes. Now let's open Process Runner and double click on new RFM slash BAPI. The new process window will pop up. Type in BAPI underscore Profit Center Group underscore Create and click OK. We are prompted to log on to SAP. Select the appropriate SAP system, enter your logon credentials, and hit OK. Before we continue, we need to link this BAPI script to our external Excel file. Simply click on the drop-down, select Use External Excel File, and locate the file. While we are on the Upload to SAP tab, let's map the controlling area to column A. Next, we will click on the Download from SAP tab, and as you can see, the fields have been mapped automatically. For this example, we will map only the desired messaging contained in the Excel file. Click on the first field, and while holding the Shift key, select all the fields underneath. Hit the Fast Map button and choose None as the mapping type. Now map the corresponding columns to the appropriate fields. We will leave columns N and O alone for now, as these will be mapped in the second BAPI script. Next, we will click on the Upload slash Download from SAP tab, and map column C to Group Name, and column D to Short Description of New Group. For this example, we will set our SAP status messaging to Always Write in column M. Click on the Home tab, and check the Turn Off Auto Status and Log column and use this column checkbox, and type in M. Our first BAPI script is now complete, so let's hit the Save button and save the process file where you would like it to be stored on your hard drive or network. You can name the process file whatever works best for you, but for convenience, let's save this file with a 1 underscore in front to indicate this is the first BAPI which will execute. Now we need to make our second BAPI script, which will be linked to the first one. Click on the file and select New Process. Double click on new RFM slash BAPI, type in BAPI underscore profit center group underscore add node, and click OK. Confirm your SAP logon, and now we need to link this new BAPI to our external Excel file. Click on the drop down and locate the external Excel file. While on the Upload to SAP tab, let's map columns A through C to the appropriate fields. Just as we did with our first BAPI, let's click on the Download from SAP tab and select all of our fields by holding down Shift when selecting the fields. Hit the Fast Map button and change the mapping type to None. Now we only need to map columns N and O because the other columns were mapped in the previous BAPI. After you have mapped the columns, let's ensure the SAP status messaging for this BAPI writes to column P. Click on the Home tab, and check the Turn Off Auto Status and Log column and use this column checkbox and type in P. Now our second BAPI is complete. Let's save this BAPI and again, for convenience, let's put a 2 underscore in front of the file name to indicate this is our second BAPI that will execute. Now let's go back to our first BAPI script by clicking File, Open, then locating and selecting the first BAPI.
We need to link our BAPI script so that after the first one runs and creates the nodes, the second one will add those nodes. Click on the Process Connection button, click on the folder icon, and locate the second BAPI script. For the use following settings for all downstream connections, just leave the default checkboxes selected because we are using the same external Excel file for both BAPI scripts. Now we are ready to run our BAPI scripts. Set the start row in the end row and then click on the run button. Confirm your SAP logon and hit OK. The first BAPI executes, immediately followed by the second. The status messaging writes directly to the Excel spreadsheet for each BAPI script. Let's take another quick look in SAP using KCH3 and verify the nodes were successfully created and added. Here we can see the new nodes, INNew, HENew, and DENew. Want to learn more about simplifying SAP with Inaware Technologies? Visit us at inaware.com. Thank you for watching.